Hello everyone and welcome back to a brand new episode of Ark Survival Ascended on the Island Ascended map. We are back and we got a great episode ahead of us. We're going to do the Gamma Broodmother battle with Captain Reptile. We have our new Tyrannus and I think that's about it that we're going to be doing. Just screaming on the new Tyrannus. Captain Reptile is pretty much going to be doing everything else. I made a quick new set of armor for myself. I just painted it a different color, just in case I die. Never know. I highly doubt it, but you never know. I don't want to lose all my good armor. With the pi with the pirate hat that you get, well, the need sickies that haven't been added to the game yet. And I've got my own weapon. I've got a cannonball launcher. It's kind of bugged right now. We actually figured out what the bug's problem is, and it's fixed. Just kind of waiting for the patch to go through Coast Forge. Yep. But, uh... It walks. It's a good walking mod. I mean, you can't see the cannonball, Ooh. which is the bug, but it, it shoots. But it causes it destruction. Yep. It's going to be awesome. I want to see how it does against the brood model. Yep. Which, I think we've got everything going. Yep. Let's see. Just gotta, uh, clever, just gotta massive put the hunter. artifacts in there, and we just got to wait oh. to load in. Please Wait, don't crash server. No pauses. Oh, yep, there we go. Here okay. we go. Okay. Make sure the dinos are in. Ooh, that looks kind of like right on the edge. I don't like that. <laughs> there we go. I will be on the back of the day at on, and all the other dinosaurs will be doing the fighting. Yep. Midnight will be on the back of his UD. Yep. I will be screaming the entire time. So I'm interested to see how this goes. I have yet to fight a boss. Um, in ASA, obviously. Oh boy, here we go. Come here, beautiful. Oh, we're in it now. Uh, okay. Where is she? Oh. Attack! Fire the cannon! Ooh. Oh my gosh! 2100 damage. Come on, everyone. Do this. Come on, Spino. How's the gun do for damage? Get her, Get her, get her, get her. Oh, that's a lot of damage for the shotgun. That's nice. We got this. Oh yeah, we got this easy. I will say, I think they've got more health now. The good mother does. Yeah. Oh, we only have 15 minutes to do this fight. That's crazy. Yeah. Well, all the dinosaurs are actually fighting it. It doesn't look like they're all biting it. Uh, no. I think a couple of them were a little too far. Uh, I need to get some meat. I'm gonna kill some some Uranios. There we go, get some healing going. Level Damage number to lower! Yeah, seriously. What level are their ranges? Because I can't scare them. Um, I don't know, they don't have a level. Really? Oh, you can't scare them anymore? Yeah. You can't scare them and it doesn't show up on screen that things are dying. Oh yeah, I noticed that too. Yeah, there's some parts, so there's some women in here. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I, I definitely made sure that they were maybe used the source. Fire the cannon! Ooh, that was a nice hit. Oh. I really need to talk to Gunnel, the guy that made the cannon mod. Oh yeah, we got him. Go on. There we go. Yep. Beautiful. Easy squeezy. Lemon peasy. Element. Oh, the blue mother has a new death animation. I just realized oh, she it does? doesn't like pull up in a ball anymore. It just like fell over. Yeah, I didn't like that ball thing that she used to do. I thought it was kind of st silly. Definitely blocked a lot. Yeah. What is it? Oh, and then it drops a supply crate. You see this, Cap? Does it? Oh, it yeah. does. Yeah, come get it. Come get it. That's your element. That's your yeah. element and your. Oh, okay. Well, you have a whole minute, so yeah, that that's your stuff oh, right yeah, there. Oh, the element and the. That's so much better than having to run to her body. to find it off your dino. Or yeah, yeah. Yeah, or, or get out the body. Let me see Man, this thing looks cool. They did a great this, job with the retexture. This spinal didn't has no damage. This spinal has like no damage. Ooh, this spinal's almost dead. Oh yeah, dead. they did. Spinal Which six. Spinal? spinal six. Oh yeah, it is spinal six. What happened to you, buddy? I think oh, he... it's got a saddle with fifty-eight. Oh uh, no. 
That's uh, why. Oh. I mean, other than that, I mean, these guys did a great, did a fantastic job. Yeah, absolutely. Couldn't ask for better. That was, what was that? That was six minutes? Something like that, yeah. No, didn't take us long at all. Too, so, bad. Too bad we don't have the taxidermy thing yet. Not yet. Not yet. Oop. I think I'm just gonna leave these spinos. I might put a feeding drop down here, but I might leave these spinos here just so they can Oop. hang out and yeah, and uh, get some some levels. Like, uh, just hang out here for the for the brood mother fight. Yeah, definitely. So let me do it again. Yeah, because you're gonna do the beta and then the alpha. Yes, definitely gonna need to pump them oh, up a little bit if we're gonna do beta on alpha though. Oh, for alpha, for a hundred percent. All right, let's go. Let's go check out your base. Oh yeah. Hey, pick me up. Thank you. There we go. They've they've nerfed the rhino. You can no longer like the rhinos fly super slow when you're picking when you're carrying it down. Oh, well. I see. Of course they did. Because why would they want to? This is me did? sprinting, by the way. Oh, jeez. Yeah, they. They nerfed her severely. Well, of course they did. Why would they want people to have fun? I don't know. Thank you. <laughs> okay, let's just... Yeah, I haven't really been here either. I only stopped by for five minutes to drop off a gift for Cap, so... I'm just gonna... Okay. My, my little just crate... Going. My little crate setup that I always do. <laughs> oh, let's yes. check out Cap's personal sign from uh, Gunner. It's beautiful. I love it. Got me my own sign, and Midnight has his too. His is right. Oh, yeah, I forgot oh, yeah, you could change it. Yep, there we go. Oh, Midnight. That looks, oh, that looks awesome. And then you probably recognize JC Hooligan, another member of the Sobo. Yep. And this was all made by the one and only. Where's his name? Is he not? He didn't make a sign for himself? I don't think he did. Well, there's the Beach Bobs. This is for us. Yep. For the whole Sobo. Yep, yep. And I think so. This is my base. So and, it's gonna... and I think Sir Caveman has one as well. Yeah, he does. He's right here. There we go. That looks cool. Looks yeah, like, it does. Looks like the cavemen from the old Geico commercials. Yeah. For some of you, yep. you're probably wondering what we're talking about. Yeah, you're too young. Yeah, they, uh, they took him away a while ago. Ooh, this looks nice. Ooh, what's in here? Aha, I knew there was this. is my this grinder room. And, and a pooper. Yep, and my toilet. Nice. I put next to the toilet, or next to the grinder. And then think... you've got my industrial room, you've got my chem bench, Ooh, and nice. you've got my industrial grill, a cooking pot, and my uh, the GDG fabricator, Yep. which this... you can find inside the GDG workbench, also yep. made by Gunner Does Games. Yep, yep. And then there's a, a... And then the smithy, um, what is it, smithy uh, mortar uh, combo he made also. There yep, there we go. I love the way this looks. I love that he added riot armor at the top. I think that's so cool. Yeah. I like the rocket launcher down here. Yeah, the rocket launcher. Now he awesome. he did a fantastic job with all the designs. I need to um, get them all made and do a little show off of them. But yeah. this is my vault room and my furnace room. It looks great. Not, and these are here. these are greenhouse windows, right? Yep. Yeah, these look yeah. so cool. Yep. And you can open them upwards. I like that you can like change the direction they open. Yeah. It's so much nicer. Yeah, I put windows in Megan's base and I did the same thing. And then up here, this cap. is just more of a lookout tower. It's a kind of a long, a long walk, but a long climb. Yeah. But it's just sort of more of a, a lookout, just to kind of get a good view of my base. Jeez. Jeez, it is a long climb. Yeah. Oh, yeah, it's long. It's a big tower. What's the max level for the server now? For dinos? No, for us. Or for characters. Characters. Uh, 105. Oh, okay. So you're almost maxed. Oh. Yeah, I'm one, one away. Yep, there's my little base. I like I like the, t the lookout tower. Yeah, I think I've... I think... If you put mine Oop. and Kyle's base next, bases next to each other, I think mine's bigger. Oop. I know he's got a pretty big base. I haven't been over to his in a while. Yeah. This looks awesome. <laughs> It looks awesome. Oh, yeah, my in K like mode. Power everything. And then we we'll have to go upstairs and jump or something. Oh, that's actually pretty high. Ouch. And then you got my personal bedroom. Oh, they need to add a slide mechanic. Yeah, they do. Something to make you get down, get down the ladder faster. Yep. And you got my personal bedroom here. 
Yeah, my personal storage box full of armor that I use a lot of. Um, that also was my resource bench when somebody over encumbered my body with a bunch of resources. <laughs> That's funny. Is that when somebody handcuffed you? Yes, I was handcuffed. And it, the handcuffs didn't even work, they were bugged. Interesting. Yeah, I see them in their storage bin. Yeah. Nice. That's and cool. then upstairs, you've got my artifact room, my fridge. I need to do more. I might put a few of the um, uh, GDG benches up here just to fill some empty spaces. Ooh, I like that. Actually, I might, I might, I might move my vaults up here because the replicator needs to go down there because mm -hmm. it's, it's big enough for it. Yeah. Oh, I like this like little thing you did right here where you put the uh, storage boxes underneath the refrigerator. Oh, yeah, I mean, the know, uh, I air this now. There we go. Oh, Ooh. that looks kind of cool. Ooh, it looks like she's holding onto them. <laughs> yeah. That does look cool. And then you'll put the then, Megapithecus at the bottom and the dragon up top. Yep. Yeah, and I, I repainted these skulls to be inverse colors of each other. Yep, yep. Yeah, that looks cool. Ooh. Yep, and then... I like this little, side and like this little lookout thing you did right here too. What lookout? Uh, right here. So you can you can kind of see your t your vault room and your uh, oh yeah, Astro Forge. Looks cool. Right, yeah, I have a little secret compartment outside too. You go up here to the ladder. Just got this little room. I don't know what it's for. I just ha oh, nice. I just have it just because. Nice. This is where you can hang out and wait for somebody to come by, like you're inviting them and then trank them or something. Yeah. Just, just to mess with some people. Yep, I mean, I do have an auto toy right here in case yeah, any dinosaurs want to come around. Uh, I mean, I can't imagine anything really coming over here except maybe something that flies by, like an RG, but they don't usually come to this area. No, those are the Wolfdown over here that got blasted, but that's about it. <laughs> yeah. Alright, and then, yep, we got my Rexes. Rexes galore. I only got two of them. Three of them, technically. Mammoths. Beautiful. Yep, we got my Mammoths, my Stegos, Stegos my Parasol. Oh, your car cars. Yeah, they're over here. These gigantic pains in the butt. Yeah, this one was a gift from Caveman after I helped him get uh, his other one. Yeah. Did L you literally named I'm a present? <laughs> <laughs> Did you disable ally looking? Yeah. Oh, okay. I don't like when I don't like the ally, uh, ally, ally looking because they just get in the way. Oh, I like it. It's cool when the depending on the creature, it's pretty cool. Well, yeah, when they look at you, it's fine, but like when you're trying to walk by and they look at you and then you get stuck and you rubber band on their face and everything, oh, yeah. and then it just gets annoying. Did you ever notice that the car car's throat wiggles when it breathes? Yeah. That is so weird. Kind of more realistic, I mean. Very, very to realistic. Me anyways. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, I forgot about your Bronto. Yeah, he's just hanging out over here. I mean, where is he going? <laughs> you, exactly. I, oh wait, you have the behemoth gate, so you can't actually get him out of here. Oh, he's got gray colors, the gray and the orange. That looks nice. Yeah, he came that way. Very nice. I got him... When did I get him? Oof, a long time ago. Yeah, I don't remember exactly where I was when I got him. Do I was you, coming back, I was going to green out for something. Do you even know what episode this is for you? Nope. This from, I lost count. I think well, I just I just uh, went through my folder before we logged in. I think this is episode fourteen or fifteen for me. Yeah, I think I'm. I think I'm at thirteen, thirteen or fourteen. Well, I got a few edited, so I haven't looked at those ones. But yeah. Oh, I just what did I edit today? I don't remember. Oh no, it was my it was a solo episode. I edited. my next episode is when I actually helped you chain the car car. Well, sort of. I just stood around and looked. <laughs> Yeah, I didn't really know what I could help with besides possibly killing stuff, but I have no experience with taming car cars, so yeah, that was really about it. But honestly, I think that's all I wanted to do this episode was fight the brood model. Yeah. Alrighty then, everyone, we are back at our base, and we've crafted the the meat spoiler from uh, Gunner Does Games mod. Added it right there. Oh, it has a little meat spoiler image above it. That's so cool. A little hologram. So, 
Um, yeah, we successfully defeated the Gamma Brew Mother with Captain Reptile. I mean, I didn't do anything really. I just stood there and screamed with my Uteranus. So, um, oh, I need water. Um, we've actually just been gathering some resources. Uh, where? Oh, duh. Come on, midnight. What is wrong with you? No. I can't recall if I showed this off on screen or not, but this is a shotgun that I found in a red drop I believe I don't know I can't even recall anymore there's so many drops and usually I either dump everything or I actually keep it so I cannot recall if I showed this in, a, in an episode and um, I came out here every so often there will be a good amount of dinos usually it's um, a few RGs or something like that let's see what level are you but, uh, level 40 okay not that one. There we go. Get my shotgun out. Um, just before I killed a couple of Uteranus and a few Carnos. Can I actually get you from here? Yep. <laughs> oh, I fell into the water. Darn. Okay, let me not keep wasting shotgun shells then. But this thing is awesome. Uh, jump. Oh, crap. Jump. Yeah. Yeah, I can't get it. No big deal. Um, I've been using Gunner's, uh, what's it called? Harvesting tool? What is this thing called? Carcass grinder. Yeah, I'm gonna call it the har. I'm gonna just call it the harvester. No. Oh. And uh, just gathering tons and tons of keratin. That thing is awesome. No. Oh. So the um, the broodmother fight with Cap didn't take very long. So I think for the rest of this episode, I want to get my greenhouse built so I can start making kibble. These Uteranus right here from the last episode have been doing a great job of providing me with eggs. So let's just go look real quick. So yeah, look at all these eggs. It's a, it's a huge amount of eggs right there. Oh, just refresh these. Actually, let me just take all of them then. Do a quick refresh. There we go. Okay, that's better. Do I have anything else in here? Oh, where'd, I, where'd I get 10 Lazarus Chowder? Oh, must have just kept getting it from drops. Alright, um... Let me see. I know I can look it up in the cooking pot, but I'm going to need to build more stuff. Um... Kibble. Is, what's the best... I think extraordinary. Yeah, okay, I need bee honey. Ugh. I know um, Sir Caveman has a, a bunch of honey at his base, so hopefully he's okay with, with sharing a little bit of that. Yeah, all the reg all the other ones are normal. Yeah, so this is the one I'm going to need to make the most of. Oh, actually, I don't even... Oh, yeah, I do need a greenhouse because I need to make the chowder. And the chowder is... Uh, potatoes, carrots. All right, so I actually don't need to grow every type of um, vegetable. I just need mostly potatoes and carrots. But knowing me, I'll just make uh, a few plots of everything. So um, let me start learning this stuff. Green, green. I know I, I learned the door already. Um, I need this ceiling, and I need this. That's it. Not gonna make anything extravagant. I'm just gonna make a nice simple um, greenhouse right on the top of my base then run the water to it um, and oh yeah crop the crop plots the or, or, uh, crop something like there we go just a large one that's all I'm gonna use oh you have to learn all of them okay and oh I don't think I showed this off that I did uh, get a dung beetle I completely forgot about a dung beetle. So, um, we found them, picked them up, and carried them back to base with our RG, dropped them off, and just had plenty of poop. So we have tons of fertilizer. I mean, this thing is full, because this has more space. So I filled this up. I think this one is full. There's two fertilizer in here. Let me put my shotgun away. I feel like this is making me run slower. Every time I click the wrong button, I keep picking something else up. Um, this storage box is full, and I think Shadow has a, the rest of it. Yeah. Yeah, look at that. So much fertilizer. 
All right, so yeah, I think I'm gonna take um, Frostbite up top, and we're gonna try getting to work on this greenhouse. Won't bore you fine people with the details, but I will bring you right back once it's sort of built. Alrighty then, we are back. Well, he got it all built. So oh, let's let's just use our Frostbite. So here it is, our first ever greenhouse on ASA. So, oh, nice and simple. I didn't want to do anything extravagant or crazy. Just nice, simple square. It's used for one thing, just to make uh, fruits and vegetables. So, let's close this door. So, yeah, here's our greenhouse. I love the new water system where you just need to put an intake pipe down into the water, and as long as the, um, the tap is within reach, it's just going to automatically pull the water. I mean, I don't mind running pipes. I got used to it from ASE, so no big deal, but yeah. So, we have our... Um, I just kind of started mixing it up instead of just you know, use, making it 100% even. But we have two saver roots right here. Then I think it's two citronol lemons. Um, two, uh, what is it called? Narco berries. Then two raw carrots. And then two long grass. Right? Yes. And then here, I just start, I just started adding one extra. I put an extra saver root. I put an extra narco berry. I put an extra raw carrot. And let's put an extra. Uh, did I say saver? Yeah, I did. Uh, okay, long grass. There we go. So yeah, so this is going to be our little greenhouse area. Um, I could build two more right here if I want, but I might actually pick this up if it doesn't break everything. Uh, yeah, and maybe put a ladder right here and put a hatch. I'll see. So, since, you know, it's still, um, there is no pull system. <laughs> as much as I would hope for a pull system, there is none. So, I'm going to have to kind of be coming up here on my own. Go away, you. <laughs> Reload. Oh, do it faster. Okay. Wrong button. Okay. Alright, so the greenhouse is built. Um, next thing I'm going to need to do is go on a gigantic metal run. Because I need to make the industrial cooker. Oh wait, does Gunner have one actually? Ooh, that's a great question. Gunner, do you have... Crafting... Okay, I know he has a forge. The jerky, the fabby... Hmm... Vault. What's this? A mini fridge. A large meat vault. No, I don't think Gunner made a cooker then. Yeah, no, no cooker. Okay. Um, let's put the rest of these seeds in here from. Oh, and the uh, rare flowers I got from with uh, Stumptress. Alright. Um, I think I make the cooker here. Okay. Do I not have it learned? No, I did not have it learned. Okay. It has to be made in the fabby. Oh, yeah, this is going to be expensive. Cooker. I don't, I don't, I don't have a, I have some of this stuff, but not everything. All right, so yeah, so we're going to work on that. Um, going to do some grinding for that, and I think that'll be the whole episode once we get that done. Uh, little dude. Oh, thank you. Uh, where's your weight? Just keep, we're just gonna keep pumping everything into your weight. Okay. We'll probably go over to the water pen and, um, take Pretty for a... Wait, was Pretty the donkey or Smile the donkey? I don't remember now. I think it's Pretty. Um, we're gonna take her out for an oil run, since that's pretty much our best way of getting oil besides whatever the dung beetle can make. So, we're making progress, people. In the next episode, we should have Kibble ready to go, and then we'll be able to start taming everything at max level, finally. Or max taming efficiency, I should say. Did you spoil all this meat? Yes, you did. Beautiful. Okay. And then we'll throw you in here. Um, 
don't have any more nerd yeah, I have plenty of narco bears. Thank you, Stumptress and um Theory from Sir Caveman. Um nar. and thank you, Gunner. See, this is what I need. I need something like this so I can just craft things quickly. <laughs> so, but alrighty then, everyone. Let me go on a metal run with uh, Frostbite and uh, Enki, and I will bring you guys back in just a little bit when we're gonna be ready to place down the industrial cooker. Oh wait, and also I gotta go see Pretty and um, get some oil. So, just a few things to do, but I will bring you guys back momentarily. Alrighty then everyone, we are back. Our greenhouse is providing an excellent amount of stuff as you guys can see right here. We got plenty of fruits and veggies, mostly veggies, these are just the one fruit. And I quickly want to make a cooker, which took me forever to gather everything for, and a grill. I should have enough, yes. Okay. These are just the last two, oops, these are like the last two things I wanted to get done. Let's see if I can fit this all in here now. Might have to move some things. Is there anything in here? No, okay. Uh, pick up Gunner's Jerky. Oh, I got rid of my compost bin. Um, I get, oh, I'm going to have to move the cooking pot because I'm not going to need that anymore. Alright, let me see. Actually, I might, pr I'll probably end up putting it there, and then the grill right here. Perfect for the grill, and then Gunner's jerky thing can go right next to it. Oh, ooh, no, no, no. Don't like that. Okay, let's try that again. There we go. Yeah, I like it flush up against the wall. And now Gunner's Jerky. A freaking new Tyrannus. Okay, do I have anything in here? Oh, I have a ton of... of uh, I'm just gonna take it all. Oh, uh, what? A fertilizer. And a few in here too. Okay. Thank you. Alright, I think the industrial cooker should go here, no problem. Are they backwards? I think they're backwards. Oh, I don't need various food recipe advanced gasoline or power to activate. Um, if I'm not mistaken, I think Gunner has some kind of fuel in his thing. Oh wait, let me make sure it's not on me that I have to make it. There it is. Okay, so I just need a bunch of bingo berries and I make biofuel. Okay. okay, so I'll do that instead, because that's probably going to last longer. I know, I probably should build this near the generator, but I don't really want to. Alright, let me... This is where I've been making all of my... There we go, I still think these are backwards for some reason. Let me try to pick that up. Okay, uh, where is it? Maybe I'm wrong. Oh, all right. So we're gonna start making um, some Lazarus chowder. So for uh, exceptional, ki extraordinary kibble. Let me just look this up real quick. Uh, crafted foods kibble. All right, exceptional. Okay, I can make exceptional. I need giant bee honey for this, but I have the eggs for it at least superior all right and yeah okay so i can pretty much make them all i just need some bee honey for this one and we'll be good to go all righty then well we're gonna call it an episode here a good episode we help reptile achieve a goal and then we just got a lot of stuff done around the base the beautiful um 
greenhouse is up top and now we have our whole little cooking area right here that I like but hope every oops hope everybody did enjoy please do like share subscribe check out the Instagram page for you better look at the thumbnails that I provide for you fine people check out all the other content creators channels and twitch channels everything also stop by the discord if you want we have a great community of people there and all good things are related but that is all for now until next time everyone take care